Well, today I went to this one door. A guy answered in a power wheelchair, and he seemed really interested in the great controversy. So I went inside, and the first thing I saw was a Bible. That looks like it hasn't been touched in a very long time. And then he kept on talking. You know, he really wanted some of these books, and he looked around for change and you know money for it, but he you know couldn't find anything. And then he asked. Does God care for him, you know? And I'm like, God cares for you. And it's like, you know, these little things that, you know, his face just immediately lit up that God does actually care for him. And a lot of these people out here, they just don't don't know that God actually cares for them. God was allow allowed me inside that house just to tell him, you know, that he, can, you know, God cares for him, that guy. And hopefully he can find it rekindle what he used to have, the spiritual candle that he used to have. And uh, my, I really hope that he will be happy. We've been working in a neighborhood with lots of military families, and I ran into a couple who just recently moved from Texas. And it was really neat because I was able to talk to them, and they were interested in a cookbook. I also offered them some of the free services that we offer, like Bible studies and was telling me how she was interested in Bible studies and she hadn't studied the Bible in a long time because after her mother's death it was difficult for her. So she's coming back to studying the Bible and was interested in correspondence studies. Yes, they got the cookbook and I also gave them the happiness for life which is the same as Steps to Christ. So that's really exciting to be able to bring that truth to people.